Hello you guys, I'm starting today's vlog in the car. We are about to head out to a hair appointment. I am stopping by my salon today to get a glaze, maybe a little trim. Definitely, I need some more face framing layers. And I haven't been to the salon probably since late October, early November. I can't really remember, but that rhymed. Um, but it's been a while. I have naturally brown hair, just like a really medium brown. And I dye it black. My hair does not look very good right now because it's really dirty and crusty. But I have to get glazes because my natural hair is brown. And if I don't, then it will kind of grow in like ashy, which obviously shows a lot with the black hair. This probably won't be a really long video, but I do get so many questions on my hair. So I figured I would just take you along with me. And you guys can refer back to this video if you ever have any questions. By the way, I have a cold sore. I want to normalize cold sores. It's like a crazy statistic that like... 80% of the population or something like that has cold sores and I just don't think it's something we should be embarrassed about anymore I'm just tired of being embarrassed about it Like it's just a bump on my lip and I'm very careful and I don't even know how I got them Honestly, I could have gotten them as a child. I don't know I've been getting them for as long as I can remember and they get triggered by stress they get triggered by vitamin C they get triggered by picking so I pick my lips a lot as you might be able to tell and I pick my fingers I have dermatillomania so when I pick my lips I think it flares up something that creates a cold sore that is how I got it this time I'll tell you that much because I was I was picking away but yeah we're gonna head off to the appointment my appointment's at 11 it's 10 15 right now it only takes me like max 30 minutes to get there so maybe I'll grab like a smoothie or something I don't know I also could order food to the salon um we'll see either way I'll keep you guys in the loop hi um can i just have a medium iced coffee with cream and sugar and caramel swirl yes thank you So normally when I come, I just do 1B, which is just like the darkest black. But today we did 1B, 2ABN, and 6G, which is gonna give me more of like a blue tone to my hair, and it's also gonna give extra shine.
Okay guys, I am back at my apartment now. Well, I'm in the car outside, but my hair is done. Of course it's raining today, like with my look. Every time I go to the hair salon, it rains. So my hair will get frizzy and probably doesn't look as amazing as it just did at the salon. But I'm so happy with the final result. I just needed that like fresh black color on my hair so badly. It just revives me, honestly. It's 118, I'm pretty hungry. I didn't end up getting anything besides my Dunkin', which I need to bring inside and put ice in because it melted and I don't wanna waste it. But I'm actually really proud of myself today because usually when I step out or go to a hair salon or an appointment, I always feel the need to get like a snack or like food, but I just went to Trader Joe's yesterday, so I'm holding myself accountable and I didn't stop and get food and I'm gonna eat at home honestly proud of myself like it seems like it's not a big deal but for me it's a big deal but my hair looks so good it's so shiny and silky and I am very happy thank you guys for watching this short little video I hope you enjoyed and be sure to like screenshot my formula I'll also put it down below for you so you can um, refer back to it. But thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all and I'll see you in my next video.